conservative club for growth, once one of Donald Trump's fiercest critics, may now be one of his biggest health care supporters. The group is now making a million dollar ad buy and taking aim at 10 moderate Republicans who they say are standing in the way of the GOP repeal and replace effort. Movement to make us great again. Now he's doing what he said, working with conservatives on a better bill that lowers premiums, cuts taxes, and repeals Obamacare. This is our chance to end Obamacare and begin delivering the reforms our people deserve. Conservatives are working to get it done. A big win for American families and our economy. Tell Congress, support Trump's plan to get rid of Obamacare. We gotta get it done. Here now, Andy Roth, the Vice President of Government Affairs at the Club for Growth. You're spending some serious cash to take on Republicans, of all people. Yeah, well, we got to get it done, like President Trump says. Listen, the only thing that's stopping us from repealing Obamacare are the costly regulations that Obamacare is currently imposing on the American people, and that's translating into higher premiums. There's 10 moderate Republicans, even more, frankly, that want to keep those regulations. And what we're saying in these ads is it's time to get rid of these regulations. You get rid of them, then we can repeal Obamacare. And, and you're saying it's time for all Republicans to do what they promised voters and back legislation that fulfills President Trump's pledge to end Obamacare and lower premiums. As we mentioned at the top of this segment, your group was once one of the fiercest critics of the president. What kind of response are you getting to this $1 million ad buy? Well, it's still early, but the, the response is very favorable. And, and as for working um, in support of Trump's agenda, this is politics. And uh, politics makes strange bedfellows. But when he's right on the policy, we're going to be there to support him. Why haven't you named all of the moderate Republicans involved here? You've named Chris Collin Collins, Adam Kinzinger. You've named three of them. Uh, you're going to be naming the rest Thursday. Why not call them out all out by name now? Sander, we can show you a little ankle, but we don't want to show you the whole leg. You're just going to have to wait a couple of days. Okay, and how do you expect them to respond? We did invite them uh, on tonight. They're on break, so kind of tough to get a hold of anybody right now. Um, but they will respond. How, what do you expect from them? Well, I don't know. It's up to them. But here's the thing is that, you know, all Republicans voted for full repeal of Obamacare. They promised it during the campaigns in 2012, 2014, 2016. President Trump himself was elected on this issue. For Republicans now to now say that they kind of want to keep uh, parts of Obamacare largely intact, that's going to disappoint some people. So what we're basically saying is, listen, do what's good for the country and let's repeal Obamacare and repeal the regulations. All right. Uh, your message is being heard loud and clear. We'll see what the impact of that is. And we'll see what the response from some of those Republicans being called out by name by your organization. Adam Roth, Club for Growth, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me.